hey there everyone so this time around i decided i'd do something a little different on the channel that i've not done for quite some time i'm going to review a full collection uh manga series in very hefty volumes the last time i did this was i think in inuyasha so yeah this is a new one this is rig veda by clamp and i know it's written as rg veda but clamp themselves said that uh, this was supposed to be pronounced as rig veda so that's what i'm going to refer to this as so this is book one this is book two and this is book three and all of them are extremely hefty books you can see this uh before we get into the books i would uh, like to ask you to subscribe to the channel if you like videos like these which have uh, illustrations have comic books um have in general good uh, artwork in them because that's what this channel is about uh if you have any comments to say or comments to uh, for any of the videos feel free to comment in the comment section if you uh, want me to review any specific book do let me know i'll try my best to get my hands on those but with that said uh, let's get to the books so let's start with volume 1 of rig veda by clamp so this is a fairly thick book this says clamp rig veda 1 on the spine and here's the blurb you can pause and read that if you want of course seeing this books you can understand these are second hand books i got them for a pretty decent deal uh i don't remember what i got them for so i cannot quote the numbers but i was it was uh around in sub 500 i'm pretty sure on that yeah so um the artwork inside is exactly brand mark clamp uh if you have seen anime like card captor sakura you'd know exactly what i'm talking about very beautiful uh people good looking people great looking people to be more specific and uh, this is not uh, westernized what i mean by that is this is not um so if you if you've seen my other videos like buddha by samudrasuka they are westernized they go from left to right uh, like a usual western book would go these are uh, japanese books transcribed into english so these go from right to left so this is the first page and then you read from right to left you go from you read the right part and then left part and so on so you read this part and then this part so that's how it goes uh, fairly easy to read read once you get the hang of it and the story is i mean uh, it's not bad but i think the story could have been better but that's just a personal thing because uh, i am comparing this with uh, better works by clamp like card captor sakura and such but yeah this is this this it's a pretty interesting story nonetheless so this this child who gets uh, im, uh, um, born as uh, like as a new life of a demon king and then what happens so as you can see the um, interestingly since they have used rigveda you can understand there's an indian uh context to these books there's an indian connection and you can look at the calligraphy here this definitely looks like the devanagari script but yeah it's not it's in english basically storm of the six stars part 2 uh it's it's not a bad book in fact i would say most people would enjoy it it was just not up to my um uh, liking but that 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 that's just a personal thing uh i won't say it's bad it's not bad by any means it's i i think uh they could have done it the story could have been better but uh, yeah that's just me with that being said let's get to book 2 this is book 2 and uh, i'll give you the blurb you can pause that and read if you want this is book 2 it's the artwork is similar to book 1 beautiful artwork i mean just for the sake of artwork this is really worth getting <coughs> i kind of liked book 2 and book 3 better than book 1 uh, so there's that uh, because book 1 has a bit of cliffhanger at the end but i think yeah book 2 and book 3 book 3 uh, re- resolves everything pretty well and there is a lot of mysticism a uh, lot of you, if you go through the books you get a lot of indian references that is true and you, if you are an indian you definitely understand what i what uh, we mean by indian references so this is the blurb at the end of 
volume 3. Volume 3 was in a much better condition than volume 1, 2. I got volume 1, 2 separately, volume 3 much later on. And I was pretty lucky that I could get a hold of this book. I'll try to leave uh, links in the description to these books on Amazon so that you can uh, look them up if you want. So, yeah, if you beautiful artwork, just look at this. So, yeah, that's about it. Rig Veda Volume 1, 2, and 3. As always, if you have any questions, any suggestions, anything to say about the books, do feel free to say them. Um, these are by Dark Horse, by the way. I forgot to mention the um, I mentioned the publisher and Dark Horse is my most favorite uh, publisher at the moment because they do great adaptations. So yeah, with that being said, um, happy reading.